Deadly ethnic violence in India's troubled Manipur state divided communities but each side tells similar stories of loved ones murdered, homes torched and harsh new lives in camps. Violent clashes erupted in Bishnupur district of the northeastern Indian state of Manipur after hundreds of Hindu Maitai women clashed with security forces to protest against planned mass burials of Christian Kuki tribesmen. At least 120 people have been killed since May in armed clashes between the predominantly Hindu Maitai majority and the mainly Christian Kuki in the northeastern state. Many in Manipur believe the number could be higher. Some 50,000 people have been forced to flee, among them teacher Ranjana Moiringtham, who was evacuated by the army after a terrifying night sheltering with 25 neighbors crowded in a room as gun battles between gangs raged around them. In Manipur, conflict erupted from a mix of causes including competition for land and public jobs, with both sides blaming state and national government for failing to stop the violence. Communities are divided. In Churachanpur, Maite are no longer welcome. Dummy coffins line the route into the district as a terrifying warning to Maite, and road signs with the Churachanpur name have been marked out because it is derived from an ancient Maite king. The community gathers at night in a makeshift chapel, praying and singing hymns in a bid to drown out the crackle of gunfire between vigilante militia forces.